Dean Polly, I'm the founder and CEO of Aerovision Africa. Uh, at this conference, I also represented uh, Kuwasa. I'm the president of Kuwasa, which is the Commercial Unmanned Aircraft Association of Southern Africa. Looking at the lineup of speakers, I must say uh, it has been of very high quality, especially with relation to uh, with regards to content. The content was incredibly rich. Um, I've been in this industry now for uh, going on three years and uh, I have been very involved in the industry in, in quite a wide variety of applications and to sit over two days and learn new stuff was just absolutely incredible. And I um, mean yesterday's closing where we looked at uh, local manufacturers in Africa uh, and what they were doing in places like Kenya was just like the cherry on the cake. Sort of wear multiple hats. I presented as on behalf of Kuwasa. Uh, I think that was quite well received. And then I presented a brand new technology. In fact, um, I failed to mention that during our presentation. So we uh, achieved a first in South Africa in aviation history by fitting the new standard uh, Mode S transponder uh, with ADSB in and out. We fitted it to a drone. Uh, we flew it, and uh, it showed up on uh, websites like www.flightradar24.com. Uh, so it's the first step of a series of tests we're gonna do. Uh, I did a full-on presentation on that and it was really well received. Uh, I was inundated with uh, queries, questions. I had the Civil Aviation Authority here. The ARPAS team was here uh, in full force. Uh, I spent quite a bit of time with them yesterday and um, they've actually endorsed uh, the use and implementation of the new uh, transponder standards. So all in all, it's been a really exciting event. Uh, I would say top quality.